WTFNN. Headline News Update. Welcome, folks. We have the Dow Industrials up 143. You get the Nasdaq up 103. S&P's up 17 and a half. Gold contract down eight dollars and sixty cents, trading at fourteen fifty-five an ounce. We have silver down fourteen cents, sixteen dollars eighty-six cents an ounce. Let's get over that gold contract because so gold's going after its lowest swing point. You get holiday trading out here, so this is going to get pretty dicey. Uh, looking at this uh, metals market right now, so the lower end of this consolidation out here right now is fourteen forty-six point two zero. Not much movement today. You are backing down at light volume, but uh, it looks to me like it is going to go after that lower swing point out here. Notes and bonds, bottom line, still want higher price, lower yield. Pretty amazing. And this is with a huge divergence in, in the marketplaces between the metals and the note and bond market. You get a 10-year up two ticks, 129.16. The 30-year up five at 160.01. And king dollar, king dollar up 54 ticks, trading 98.324. Euro is at 110. Yen is at 108.97. And the pound is at one. 29 to 1 U.S. dollar. We get over and take a look at the S&Ps. You're at an all-time high inside the S&Ps. SPY out here right now is trading at $312.93. Last high generated last week was $312.69. NDX 100, same type of setup inside the NDX. NDX 100 right now trading at 203.92. That's taken out the high that was generated last week at 203.84. And small caps. Small caps have caught a monster bid out here. Small caps are trying to get away from the consolidation that they've been in. Now, this is pretty intense, though. So the, the small caps, folks, topped out in July of 2018. It's been in a consolidation going all the way back to uh, December of 2018. Uh, bottom line is that we're at 161.67 inside the IWM, 161.11, uh, rather. Uh, is the number to keep your eye on. That's the top of the consolidation. We hit that on the week of May 10th uh, of this year. So we'll see whether it's going to be enough. On the daily, guess what? It doesn't have the volume. Bottom line is, though, uh, if it gets up and over that, then you can see it start denting into the downdraft. Uh, there was two vicious downdrafts in October. We went from uh, 169 down to 151 in all of eight trading days. Stay right there, folks. Coming right back. Last 60 minutes of trading. And, of course, we get the holiday week happening. There's going to be a light volume out here. Bottom line is that they get price moving in a big way, though. Coming right back.